When writing for academic purposes, it is very important to think critically about the resources you use. This video goes through 10 pivotal questions you should ask yourself about any information source. We are using a Te Ara page on Caesar Roos as an example, but please note that not all sources and websites will have answers to all 10 questions. If you need help assessing a source, please contact the library. Question 1. What date is the information? When was the resource written or last updated? Is the subject topic constantly changing, such as with science and technology? And have you got the most up-to-date information possible? Question 2. Is there an abstract or summary or keywords and what does this tell you? Abstracts and summaries confirm what an article is about without you having to read the full text. They include key points and subjects covered. Question 3. Is the website or document or video funded by an institution? Check if the resource has been funded or sponsored by a person or an institution. Be careful about the point of view of the creator. This may be biased towards the person or organisation that paid to have it created. Question 4. Who wrote the information? This may be a person or an organisation, but you should search for information on them. Who do they work for? What is their reputation? Is it a trusted source? Question 5. What is the expertise of the writer or writers? Are they qualified to comment on this topic? Have other academics cited this resource in their studies? Question 6. What evidence is used? Are there any references? How have the authors formed their argument? Are there solid references used along with a full list at the end so you can follow up on the original source? Question 7. What genre is the resource? For example, is it original research or is it a summary of somebody else's research? Using original research is preferable. Is it a news item or an opinion, editorial or commentary piece? Be wary of resources that are stating one person's opinion. Question 8. Why was it written? Is it to educate? To sell something? To criticise? Is it political? Does it support a particular group? Understanding why it was written can help identify any bias on the part of the author. Question 9. Who is the intended audience? Is it aimed at school children, people working in a particular industry, academics or university students? Is the level of writing appropriate for university level assignments? Question 10. What is not being discussed? And what are the consequences of this? Does it address all sides of the argument? Or is it one-sided? And if so, why has the author omitted information? By asking yourself these 10 pivotal questions, you can help ensure you produce quality academic work. If you need help assessing the source, please contact the library. We recommend you watch these videos. For more assistance, please contact the library.